Hey my pretties, welcome back. So it's been a long time since I did a video in Barnes and Nobles um, and that's where we're at. So I'm gonna go in here. I'm trying not to show these kids at the front door but they, they just stand in there. So <laughs> I'm gonna stop this right here and go inside the store. But yeah, that's where we're at today. Activity kits. Okay, let's see what's out here. These are the $10 books. Ooh, Grimm's Fairy Tales. You have classical mythology, tales of, from the tales of the samurai, and Frankenstein. Ooh, you guys know I love me some Frankenstein. Okay, so good selection for ten dollars. These are twelve. Epic Norse myths and tales. What is this one? Epic. Witches, wizards, seers, and healers, myths, and tales. Okay, let's see what's at this first table. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have a book that you recommend. Um, for anybody to read so if you guys are looking for a good book look down in the comments I'm relying on you guys to tell me a book that you might you know think that I might want to read tell me the title and then tell me why you think I want to read it I keep seeing this book at Target I heard it was pretty good That sounds like it would be good. Winner of the Pulitzer Prize, The Night Watchman. Isn't that a movie? I don't know. Okay, just scanning through some of the um, stationary stuff. That's a Swedish sponge cloth. Cute little pencil uh, pouches, $17.50. Mushrooms everywhere. I've been seeing mushrooms in every store. Oh, that's cute. Bees and honey. Okay, these are 50% off. Wings, eb wings of Ebony. The Wicked Ones. This is a Disney book. That's the Mean Sisters. <laughs> The Davenports. They have wealth and reputation. Now is their chance to find love. It says exclusive edition. So 50% off of 20. So not bad. Ooh. Does that say delicious monsters? Yep. Author of Blood Like Magic and Blood Like, Blood like Fate. That might be interesting. Some of the cute kids books right here. Dolly Parton. <laughs> Dolly Parton's Billy the Kid makes it big. A is for ambitious. We are here. Rise up and write it, okay. The rainbow snail. I think I heard about that one too. Oh, that's cute. My daughter, I used to always come to Barnes and Nobles. I don't know if you guys have been following me for a very long time. Nah, I used to go to Barnes and Nobles and um, pick out books for my daughter. I probably would have picked out something like that or even this one. Yep, now it's Pooh Bear's turn. So I'm always picking him up stuff. Who are your people? Oh. 
graveyard girls. Oh, look at that. Some washi tape. It's supposed to be sushi inspired. I found it right here, so I'm going to leave it right here. <laughs> the unfortunates. have another question who is you guys favorite author my favorite author um, passed away recently which was Eric Jerome Dickey I absolutely love all of his books I have them I think I have them all <laughs> in my collection so yes he was my favorite look at the little rabbits BT 21 is that that little BTS group or something I think that's who those are who they are right I don't know oh yep beyond the story I didn't even know they had a book what Samuel Jackson has a book I didn't know that <laughs> that's cool and RuPaul the West Side Story that used to be one of my favorite movies growing up Jimi Hendrix. We Over Me. Permission to Offend. Okay. If you don't know about your love languages, then um, this is a good book to pick up. I've actually read that in the past. A Little God Time for Men. Daily Devotions for a Woman of Prayer. I like that book. Um, there's some tarot over here. God is Among Us. I find tarot cards to be very interesting. I don't I don't know how to read them, but I like how you can get all the different ones for different people's personalities. Uh, look at that one. Spooky tarot. Creepy and cute. <laughs> the essential. Cats rule the earth. I know a lot of people don't like tarot. I'm just looking for anybody that does like it. You even have Hocus Pocus, Disney. Okay, it is so hard to go through a bookstore and film because I want to look at everything. And you guys know it is entirely too much stuff in here to see. <laughs> a proposal they can't refuse. I fell in love with Hope. Oh, that might be good too. The Secret Lives of Church Ladies. National Book Award finalist. Uh huh. And look at that one. Is there still sex in the city? <laughs> <laughs> oh look they have a nightmare before christmas uh yachty 23 dollars mm, her eyes is big <laughs> All the little stuffed animals back here. Look at the cat in the roll. <laughs> mm -mm. He looking all smug like he ready to fight. Okay. And the cat with an avocado. That's cute. And it's little too with his little arms.
Oh, that's cute. The little gumball machine. Ah, uh -huh. I knew something was gonna fall. Goodness. I think they're part, is that Hermione? I don't know. No, that's not Hermione's hair color, right? But why they got the glasses on her? <laughs> okay, I'm guilty. I like looking at kids' books. Look at that grumpy mon monkey freshly squeezed. That's why I just get, I get a kick out of reading books to the kids. I think I might be more entertained than them sometimes. <laughs> oh, look at that. That, ooh, that glass is $15. That's a planner for 18. A little cat planner. Oh, and it's Kate Spade for 37. Kind of want to open it. Oh, it's nice and colorful. In case you need reminding, this planner will tell you every time you look at it. <laughs> okay, you guys, I think I am done in here um saw all there is to see yeah i just kind of wanted to come in here and scan the shelves since it's been a minute i hope you guys enjoyed this hope you saw something you might want to pick up um and don't forget to leave me my um information down below and i'll talk to you guys real soon in my next video okay bye yellow face